Don't get Namthrax. Don't get Namthrax. Wear your earplugs. And uh, rock. Miss bumps <laughs> instead of handshakes. <laughs> and uh, yeah, I don't know. I think that's it. All right. Nam, official first day. <laughs> Blog section. I had a very successful first meeting, and now I'm gonna enter the hallways for the first time at NAM 2020. Is this a good replacement for Pro Tools? Say if I'm using Pro Tools Ooh, and then the console at the same time at the moment, and I'm getting a bit possible. I'm very, I'm new to the X4. Sure. It, uh, so Luna will transform your uh, Thunderbolt enabled Apollo into uh, the most inspiring and fully integrated recording system available. And it's Mac at the moment, right? Mac only at the moment. Mac only, but PC will be coming? Uh, we don't speak on future developments okay. until they're ready. Okay, fair enough. How long has this been in the works? I heard it was like four, five years. Well, five years now. Five years. Yeah, they've been working on this for five years. That's so awesome. It yeah. looks so good. It is getting truly insane. Look at what I'm about to walk into. It's getting, it's getting club night-esque at the NAMM show. PRS have a brand new booth, which is very exciting for the 35th anniversary. There is going to be a press conference later, which I'm lucky enough to be invited to. There's a seven string, he's using them on tour, he's using them in the studio. Oh, yeah. Bev, he loves this thing, right? To that end. This is called a nebula. And we sold all these, right, Bev? How many were there? So we sold 500 of these in another minute. And what it happens is it's a, called a flip flop paint in the car business, where you, as you change the direction, it changes the color that it is. It's not so easy to do in nitro. It's not done normally with nitro. It's usually done with acrylic urethane. And this was a tremendous amount of time and energy put into these things. It's an incredible value that you can get these kind of trick car paint on a guitar for only a hundred bucks more. And we're really pleased with this. And we've sold them all. Now that doesn't mean they're sold. What that means is we have an order for 500 of them. We still have to make them. Then the dealers still have to buy them, and then you guys have to take them to the dealers. So this is the beginning of the process. So this is the Nebula, a limited run, rosewood fingerboard only, even though the Maples were introduced this year. This one, there were 500. I believe they've all been sold. I don't remember how many are domestic. I believe 300 domestic. Um, so check for signature dealers um, to see if you know somebody's got one. Grab it quick, because I don't think they'll last. Paul was talking about this in the press conference. It's, it's similar to a technique they use on car paints to get kind of that um, iridescent as you turn it, it changes. Um, there may be like a hundred bucks more than a regular Silver Sky. They're not really that much more. Um, and he said it was very hard to do in a, in a um, nitro, which, not being a, a chemist, I have no idea why, but I take his word for it. Um, but yeah, it's pretty wild.
Same net profile, but just for the satin nitrogen. Yeah, satin. That that feels. <laughs> and you can you can get all eight colors in either net option, so you can get it with rosewood or maple. That's like my Rubia <laughs> signature, right. but not quite the same. <laughs> I was about to get caffeinated. Yeah. We're about to run about guitars. Um, anyway, okay. that's that. Daily blogging is awkward. That's what we've decided. Bye. 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 I just saw Greg Cock, and oh my god. <laughs> oh, it's just like, who's who? So I just saw Greg Cock. And he asked where Mick and Dan were. Mick and Dan, where are you? Why are you not here? Some of you may know I used to work for Shaw. And um, this is my friend Soren, who's just going to take us through some of the new earphones and headphones because they are super sexy. They are dope. So this is our new uh, True Wireless adapter. Uh, many of you musicians, your Mary Spender followers, might know that we have these uh, detachable earphones. We have a whole line of them. They come with lightning cables and Bluetooth adapters and universal cables. Uh, now, long story short, you can just get this little Bluetooth adapter and they live right behind your ear, right here. Uh, charge is something like eight hours. The case gives you three hours too. I assume these are Bluetooth as well. They are. These are our first dedicated Bluetooth headphones. They're called the Aonic 50. Uh, they feature some amazing noise cancelling and some environmental modes, so you can you can get some rejection while not getting hit by a bus while you're walking around or anything. So you can hear, it's important. You, you can hear your uh, you can hear outside world as well. Your noise rejection. They like, sound amazing. I like the the right and left. Yes. That really that's. It's on you if you mess that up. It's such a now. simple touch, but that's that's useful. Yeah. They're super comfortable. Uh, they're awesome on planes. They're, they're just they're really 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 great sounding headphones. That's all there is to it, man. It's, it's pretty cool to see these things come to fruition because I knew about them a long time ago. Had to keep schooling. That's right. But now yeah. it's all good. It's all yeah, good. And, now see and we the can actually wear them on the planes and stuff like that. So yeah. They're public info. Awesome. Aonic 50. Check it out. Okay, now there is a panel that David Ryan Harris, Rabia, are going to be on talking about the Universal Oxbox. So I am pretty excited to see that, but I just need to figure out how to get back in. Gibson guitars. I'm a Gibson guy. Ooh. 
So uh, I, uh, I'm very excited to be with Gibson, and uh, they're awesome, and Gibsons are awesome, so I'm very awesome. Ow! <laughs> Perfect. Perfect spokesperson for Gibson right there. Oh, he's, over, he's out. He's out. All right. Um, cool. Hit yeah, me up man. when you're in the UK. Yeah, man. Yes. See ya! Yeah. <laughs> Bye. It has been a very successful first day of NAM, first official day. And yeah, I just want to say thank you very much for watching this series of vlogs. I hope some more exciting stuff will happen. I didn't expect to meet David Ryan Harris. Didn't expect to see Phil X, so... NAM, the wonderful, crazy world of NAM. But if you haven't already, please subscribe, give this video a thumbs up. And we're definitely going the wrong way. So we're gonna, <laughs> I'm, I think I'm gonna call it quits. I'm going to a Martin dinner tonight, so I probably won't be able to film, um, but I will see you tomorrow.